<laughs> you go home with the adoption It's of random people from upstairs. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Well, you do have a lot of books. And you've got the kind of weird nurturing attitude that other type of teachers have, so... That isn't very surprising. Still. I'm very glad to have you living here. Did you want something? What is it? Okay. Now, that would kind of be... I, I've been asking that question all sardonically and stuff, but I don't know if I want to be me. Mm. Ah, nothing. Alright. I'm gonna have to ask that to move the plot forward, aren't I? The size of the pie and spread it too, too much for you to eat it. Alright. Seventy-two uses for snails. How about it? Ugh. Alright. Here is an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails talk really slowly? Just kidding. Snails don't talk. You know, I wouldn't even know that, considering I've had plants and other such nonsense talk to me right now. Interesting. Yeah. Bother me if you need anything else. Alright, let's ask. Since I'm not getting anything else, I have to do something. Stay here. Alright, my apologies if there was noise. Slipping in the background a minute ago, I let the cat out. Anyway, let's go see what's up with Toriel now. Since she probably went down here, since the one place that I like wasn't allowed to go. You should know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. The one way exit to the rest of the island. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to... Okay, now this is turning creepy. Now be a good child and go upstairs. I don't think so, lady. You can't just make me your surrogate adopted child thing. Against my will, if I want to go home. Every human that falls down here needs the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You met with child, you leave the ruins. They, as a door, will kill you. I am only protecting you, don't do you understand? Though dear, you are not my real parent. I only just met you. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Uh, you want to leave so badly. Hmph. <laughs> you are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. You must go away. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Torio blocks the way. Alright, lady. Talk. You couldn't think of a conversation. Of any conversation topics. Oh god. That is so much stuff happening. This is a pretty jamming song though. Bam. Oh, she has so much HP. I regret using that spider donut. Bam.
Okay. Boom. Oh wow, I just noticed that she's never actually aiming at me, it seems. I just kept moving into them like a dummy. So if I just stay still... Trying to mess me up by coming from the right? Get out of here, game. I'm trying to screw with my juju. Oh, what? I did not mean to straight up kill her. Asgore, do not let Asgore take your soul. His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. Be good, won't you? My child. Well, you see, I feel kind of bad for that one, but I feel like I was trapped into doing it. Ah, whatever. Schwoops. I'll get over it. She was way more attached to me anyway. Oh, not you again. Well, she could break the rules. She tried so hard to save a few humans, but when it came down to it, <laughs> she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. You flower guy? I don't like you. Right, come back here. Uh, I guess that was the prologue. By Toby Fox. Well, I'm in for a treat. That seems pretty interesting so far. I think I'm going to stop the recording at the next save point. Any camera hidden in the bushes? What? Not right here. Tough looking branch, it's too heavy to pick up. What? It does not look that big. Oh, that was ominous. Alright, so walking backwards to see what's coming doesn't work. Oh, cool. Bridge thing. <laughs> Human. Don't you know how to do me how? Turn around and shake my hand. Oh, I've seen you before. <laughs> oh, whoopee cushion and the hand trick. I guess it's better than the electric hand trick. 
It's always fun. Alright, dude, you better quit making that noise. But we will have problems. That's hilarious. Sans. Sans the skeleton. Alright, Sans Serif. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for cubes right now. Can I make this go away? Oh, no. I don't really care about capturing anybody. Not my brother, Papyrus. You guys have weird names. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey. Actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate for me. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop him. Quick. Behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Oh. Reaper Hunter. Master of lamp shading. Oh. I think I've seen that dude too. You know what? Sup, brother. It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. You wanna look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. There's 150 or more of us. You better be on your toes. And then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses of fruit water. Okay, dude. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle? Uh, okay. I may end up adopting that word at some point. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've got a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> a skeleton. Oh, I like you, Sans. Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> Ugh. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> that was funny too. Yeah. He just needed that extra one at the end there, didn't he? We ought to get going, he might come back, and if he does, we'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. What's the hold up? Look, it's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a dark cabin filled with skeletons and horrible monsters. <laughs> well. Just a conveniently shaped lamp. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. What? Why? Okay. Ugh. Actually, hey. Hate to bother you. But can you do me a favor? I was thinking. My brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you just might make his day. You want to use me as a... You want to use me as bait to boost your brother's self-esteem? Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks, Amelia. I'll be up ahead.
I'm gonna grab this treasure chest right here. I think it's treasure chest, and then hit that save point. And then, I'm gonna call it a day. Use the box. Yes. Oh, sweet. We'll put the stick in the ribbon away, I guess. Sweet. Snow Drake. What the? Okay, I get the, it's supposed to be a like dragon thing. Snow. Oh my god. I can't play these reindeer games right now. Heckle. You make a bad ice bomb. I've heard that one. So, uh, I should have hit that save point. Stay determined. I should have hit that save point before. <laughs> Schwips. Alright, well, um, yeah. We're gonna stop the recording here. I'm gonna get back to where I was. And then, I'll see you next time.